extra focused, he levels up. So Maxime Vachelegrave must be well prepared here. Loves to play aggressive chess. He's also incredibly well prepared. I have seen him bash out moves and moves of theory. And uh, there we see Maxime focused. Yeah, he's also one of the biggest uh, strengths of the upgrade Mumba Masters team. He beat Vishy Anand yesterday. So he's looking in good form here. Let's see how this game shapes up. The arbiter signals the start of the game and E4 it is, Yoanka. Yes, and uh, Max, well, perhaps <laughs> surprising us a little bit on the first move by actually pushing his queen's pawn one square forward. Now, this is also another surprise because he just challenges the Santa immediately and the setup that he's chosen isn't the most aggressive line. Now, be careful here because there was a threat of Bishop takes pawn, but of course, uh, Magnus sees that and he castles and so far this has been played before many 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 times right uh, for now uh, Yovanka this opening which has been chosen is known as the Philidor and uh, Magnus tries to play it every time he wants to win with the black pieces he did so recently even at the Olympiad because here the pieces are not in contact with each other very soon and Magnus is like, I'll keep on maneuvering for a long game and try to outplay you. Exactly. And you know, he's kind of keeping the tension there in the center. There hasn't been any trades before. So it's looking really, really tense. Now for Magnus, the big thing for him is he has to untangle his pieces because as you can see, the knight there in the center, it's in the way of the bishop. And this is the big quest. And there we see Maxime, he's just grabbing that space there on the left side of the board, you know, advancing that pawn as far as it, pawn, as it can. And the whole idea is that pawn will act as a clamp. And, uh, okay, Magnus. Pawn pushes the pawn forward. We yeah. move to the icon board where Magnus Carlsen and MVL have made several moves, Yovanka. It's very interesting to see what has happened. But just looking at the clock timings, there's not much to choose between them. They both have almost even time on the clock. Oh, and an interesting development has kind of occurred because we left it with Maxime, you know, advancing the pawn in the center. And Magnus quickly responded by just grabbing that space on the queen's side. The bishop retreats because it was attacked. And now after this liquidation in the center by the pawns, what we're going to see here is, wow, that's a very interesting move because it does concede a square. Right, Magnus could have actually chopped off this knight but instead he decided to push the pawn and Maxime said thank you so much and put his bishop right in there. Well, Magnus took it but then the knight jumped in and I think uh, Yovanka this is a very irritating knight for the rook. <laughs> it is, I mean the rook definitely has to slide one square to get out of his harm's way but um when we look at that knight, knights, they increase almost in value if they're supported by pawns because that knight is going to be very difficult to remove. And when you also consider that there is a big central square there in the middle, which is also completely undefended, which is right for the knight to jump back in there or the bishop to come. So that's a Max, juicy square. It is certainly a juicy square. And that's what you want to do with your pieces. You just want to get them to good squares preferably on your opponent's side of the board and uh, there we see Maxime just lift the queen two squares getting ready
Lampard is actually pressing on board number three, uh, and uh, Alpine SG Pipers are doing well there. Actually, Raunak is the one who's putting pressure on board number six. So you know, Upgrad Mumbai Masters are not out of it yet. And what is happening here? Because Maxim has an extra pawn. Yeah, he's two minutes for uh, Maxim and three minutes for Magnus. Okay, but uh, this means that Maxim just has to hurry up and there he just pushes his pawns but the question is you gotta play quickly and if you want to nurture any kind of advantage you have to play precisely and uh, now Knight comes in attacking the pawn yeah. I'm expecting the pawn to actually move one square forward but the King Magnus gives a check King, uh, Ivanka, knights careful, are very careful, tricky careful, careful. Yeah. <laughs> did you just see what Magnus was uh, doing okay and now uh, a set of pawns have left but keep even careful you can't capture that pawn can't take here just to show our viewers here if you get greedy then there's this rook takes bishop and the knight jumps in and gives a check and wins it so back to the game right now two pawns up for maxime washia lagram the engine still shows it as equal but maybe that's not the feeling that the players have <laughs> definitely not no magnus will be feeling the heat but the question for Maxim is he must maintain that two pawn advantage. If one of them falls, then it simply will be a draw. Yeah, right now you can see there Maxim thinking and you, you, as Magnus, you would not be giving up your hopes here because remember there's the clock and Maxim has just one minute left on the clock it seems. Okay, Magnus winning one pawn. Now the big goal for Magnus is he can actually give up his bishop for White's remaining pawn and then it will be an elementary draw but there is the clock situation because Maxime just 55 seconds right uh, I don't even know who's going to play for a win here Yoanka because while White has an extra pawn Magnus has almost an extra minute on the clock yeah I think it's now time for Maxime perhaps to pull the break yeah, just draw the game just draw the game but you, you never know what's going to happen on the other boards uh, because uh, Peter Swidler is losing, Richard Rapport is better. So Raulak Sadwani has to strike if uh, Upgrad Mumbai Masters need to have chance or else the Alpine SG Pipers are winning this. Yes, but uh, just 46 seconds there for Maxim and he is trying to score. He's trying to win. He's trying to win this. Oh my god. Bro. And he's looking oh, he's around. He's looking at the other boards. Maxim, you don't have so no. much time. Concentrate, concentrate, do the job. Draw. And, oh, uh, he agrees. Yes. Oh, a very bold decision, by the way, because if, and you can see that Magnus doesn't even know what's happening on other 